Yes, yes, Kenya. Tamu sana, tamu sana, tamu sana, yes. About one hour ago, as I speak, Babu Owino, taking to his social media accounts, shared out this post. Babu Owino, he party leader ya ODM ni pewe baba akiwacha. ODM will be more vibrant under my leadership. Thus, Babu Owino. So, Babu is requesting that he should be given the position of ODM party leader should Raila Odinga quit. And if you go through the comments upon Babu Wino sharing out that post, I'm hoping majority of comments are in support of his ability to lead ODM party. A confirmation that maybe Kenyans and ODM supporters have got confidence in Babu Owino leading ODM party. But can ODM give Babu Owino that party leader's position? Can Babu Owino be given that position? I want us to dig deep into this, in which I'm also going to explain what it means for Babu Owino to hold that position as ODM's party leader. If you are watching us but you have not yet subscribed, subscribe, give this video a like. Let's proceed. For Babu Owino to be given that post as ODM party leader, he has just to be in good books with Rai Lodinga, after which Rai Lodinga will endorse him. Upon Rai Lodinga endorsing him, he will be the automatic party leader of ODM. And just as I did explain yesterday, the party leader of ODM is the automatic presidential candidate of ODM. So in the event ODM decides to contest for the presidency, the party leader is the automatic candidate. So Babu being given that post means he will be the ODM's presidential candidate come the next election. Let's now assume he's given that post as the party leader. What should Kenyans and more so ODM supporters expect? If Babu is the party leader, the Luo nation will rally behind him, rendering Raila Odinga and his allies politically irrelevant in the Luo nation. So Babu Owino being given that post means he will retire Rail Udinga and Raila's allies. That is the first thing coming out very clear to me. And that's also something that makes me feel ODM party might not endorse Babu Owino as its party leader. He will retire almost all the top leaders in ODM party. The second expectation, if Babu Owino is given that post, a new group of allies will surround him. Just as we are seeing with Rai Odinga being surrounded by some close allies, Babu Owino will also be surrounded by some close allies. And uh, the hustlers, or rather the people, will not easily access Babu Owino the way they are accessing him now. The new allies will not allow the people to access Babu Owino that easily. So it will be the same game with what we are seeing with Raila Odinga. If Babu Owino is the ODM party leader, then the Luo nation will be back to 1997 when Raila Odinga first contested for the presidency. That's what I'm seeing here. And also, I'm seeing a Babu Owino who will advance agitation politics just as Raila Odinga has been doing, hitting the government. 
And for Babu Owina, I just don't know how it will augur with the people. Because again, looking at the law nation, it appears they are fed up of being in the opposition. They have been in the opposition agitating for so many years. I don't think whether they'll also buy that idea of Babu Owino of being in the position agitating for better governance. I just don't know how it will augur with him on that front. But above all, as I conclude, Babu Owino being given that position as ODM party leader will actually solidify his support base across the country. In ODM strongholds, we might find them supporting Babu Owino. Assuming he is the party leader of ODM. And for those who have been keenly following Babu Owino, Babu Owino has slowed down. I'm not seeing him coming out very aggressively, campaigning to succeed Raila Odinga the way he was doing before. And in this forum, not once, not twice, but on several locations, I've been telling Babu Owino to go slow. And it appears he has slowed down a bit. We are now not seeing Babu Owino touring the Luo Nation, trying to outdo Raila Odinga, or trying to retire Raila Odinga. He has gone slow. And even from this post, he's saying, he party leader ya ODM Nipewe, Baba Akiwacha. He's not saying that Baba Kenda Eyu, Baba Akiwacha. Meaning he's ready to be patient till Raila Odinga retires. And that should be Baba Owino's style of campaigns. He should not be talking that Upon Raila Odinga going to AU, then he'll be the leader known. He should still be loyal and be patient. He should be meeting ODM caucuses across the country. Let him prove his leadership to these various groups within ODM party. After these groups have endorsed him, if Raila Odinga retires, then Babu Wino will be too strong to be stopped. And should they stop him at that time, then he'll easily walk away with a huge chunk of ODM party. But the way he has been campaigning, that was tactless and he was on a suicide mission. And I've been explaining all those in this forum. But it's good. I'm seeing Babu Owino is now going slow, which can augur very well for him in the long run. Let me stop it there. If you are watching us but you have not yet subscribed, subscribe, give the video a like. Any person watching us outside Kenya, drop a comment, let us know from which part of the globe you are watching us from. If possible, subscribe, give the video a like. Thank you. God bless you. God bless Kenya.